Hey, hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. For one starts a very spooky trail. This place is definitely not as friendly as the other areas. Well, it doesn't look as friendly, but the enemies are virtually the same. Ow. How the heck did that even happen anyway? <laughs> Uh, these new guys react just like the boss. You have to kill them from above by dropping an enemy down on top of their heads. Little plant guy there. Uh, gimme. I would like to get gem and kill the guy at the same time. I've seen that up there, but I can't get that until I go around. I believe that this thing is a bonus room of sorts. What you're supposed to do is do that and get to the fairy and... No, that's gonna waste so much time. Cause I need to do that and go. Ah, well, there's a checkpoint there anyway. But, so I guess it's worth coming in there in general, even if it is just kind of like a bonus room. Wait, wait, I need to need a guy to get up there. Cannot make that jump normally. And come on, I believe I to kill. No, I. Don't. Because I wasn't sure what I wanted to do there. Because I believe I can do like a little skip to get up to... There's a room up over there. And you can skip up there by using an enemy. And then using the little birdie friend there to jump up there. Otherwise you'd have to do it like this. And this is kind of awkward to do. Okay, that wasn't that bad. <laughs> uh, I got another double jump sequence going on here. I want to get it to the top of the jump height. There we go. Not too shabby, I, if I do say so myself. And now I can progress. Checkpoint! Holy Toledo! <laughs> and that was ridiculously easy, actually. It's just that that guy was huge. Or plant, or whatever those things are. I have no idea. I still haven't looked up the enemy names. Nor am I really all that concerned about it. Oh, those enemies you can only pick up when they're popped out of their shell, if you couldn't tell there at the moment. I just instinctively grabbed onto them, or tried to grab onto it with Hugo. Oh, and you can also only kill them when their shell is open, like that. Come on, shoot, shoot, shoot. And... Oh, it was a little too late. Come on, shoot. And you failed. <laughs> wait, wait, do I want to go up here? Is there anything of interest up? Whoa, what? What the... I didn't notice that before. Those things were up there, so that's just like a separate path of sorts. Wait, 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 wait. I want to go down there first, because I recall there being a teensy tiny secret. Well, not, not really a secret, because it's like right there. Oh, I can only grab them from the front, my bad. <laughs> Try to aim at the egg, and you get a gold coin, which is worth three lives. One of the very few in the game, actually. I don't know the locations of all of them, but you just like really, really rarely see them. But I guess that's no big deal anyway, because this game gives away lives like crazy. And oh my goodness! Spooky specters! Yeah, these are a new kind of enemy, but they're so easy, you just grab onto them, and that's pretty much it. These guys, however, are pretty tricky, because you can only grab onto them by whichever side of the ball that they are uh, grabbing onto. So you gotta pay attention to them before you jump into that fire wheel thingy, and that was a really risky jump on my part. Should not have done that. But it, it turned out well in the end anyway, so I'm not complaining. That guy's gonna jump in the foreground, isn't he? Yeah. Oh no, he's just gonna throw some poopers around. By poopers, I mean little spike balls. Hmm. Yeah, these guys, they, they home in on you, but they're, just, they're so slow. They just don't do very much. <laughs> They're just there. They're there to look cute. Guess I'm giggling at the ghosties here. And see, I was able to grab him because he was on the other. I mean, he was on the side of the ball that I was at. And these platforms, be careful when you jump on them because they do that and they'll not get you knocked off. And over bottomless pit is kind of dangerous. In case you didn't realize that. <laughs> Double jump. Yeah like a boss and over here got another one of those jumps it's just a little higher but it's spaced about the same actually uh, extra life up there need the birdie don't I yep hey. that is not hard to get at all and the camera angle just pretty much pointed it out to me altogether so I was like hey this is a hidden thing but it's not all that hidden 
And I haven't really been keeping track of the lives that I've been getting here either. I wonder how many lives I do have. I have a feeling that I collected quite a lot of them by now. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, oh, see what I mean about that you can't grab them at certain angles? Um, fairy, get your bonus points if you care about it. <laughs> Run, 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 avoid the ghosts! Oh, that's as far as it goes, I guess. <laughs> um, checkpoints... I'm doing a pretty good job of keeping this level very efficient in my, uh, run through it. Because I feel I'm near the end already. I mean, I've got nearly all the pieces of that little... Well, I know it's not all the pieces, it's all the villagers, but I mean, they all form a piece of a puzzle to put together that little symbol, the tribe symbol thing. Yeah, I'm just gonna avoid you all together because you're really annoying. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, this one. This one could give me some trouble. I remember this. See that? It's right in the middle. Now, the issue with that is I need to grab a guy without falling off and then throw it at that thing without falling off. <laughs> Come on. Oh! That frightened me a little bit, but it, it worked out in the end. Oh! Oh, that's okay. There's only, I mean, there's a bonus spot up above here if you use a little critter to get up there. See that platform up there? There's a bunch of gems and stuff up there if you want, ow. If you want to get that, I'm messing around here a lot. But uh, I, I missed out on that because I landed on this platform. You know what? Just because this is going to end up being a really short part, I'll just show that for the heck of it. Because I know that that door that I was right by was the end of the level. This is just something completely optional I'd like to show off, because the area up there is a pretty neat little area, and just thought, hey, what the heck, why not show it as long as I'm there? By the way, it's easier to get that when I'm on this platform. I don't know why I tried to get it on the other one before. So there you go. Guess, guess it's a good thing that I re-showed that. So is re-showed a word? It might be. It would be more like a rerun in this case. Okay. There's the last... Last one again. Eh. Good. I'm gonna grab the 30 again and get up here. And isn't this a really nice little detailed area here? It's got the. It's, it looks like it's lit up by some sort of lantern or something like that. It's a lot different than the rest of the areas in this place. And there's the end of the level. <laughs> yeah, like I said, I was just right there. And well, I hope you enjoyed this part, and I will see you in the next part. Really, really short level compared to the last ones, but. Yeah, that's how things go. Ta -da! Save already, man!